My name is Olivia, and today I'm going to talk about plastic pollution and how it affects marine life. My friend went to Lake Superior, where the beach was covered with plastic. Most of my friends, including myself, love sea animals, and one of them said, humans and sea animals make a great community, yet most of them are an extinct population where they die by human actions. A 1961 in-governmental organization called the OECD has 38 member countries including France, United Kingdom, and United States. This organization is important for world trade and the economic progress. From a recent OECD report, only 9% of plastic is recycled. Meanwhile, the world is creating twice as much plastic as two decades ago. Not to mention, nearly half of all plastic is being produced in these OECD countries. Depending on the region, plastic waste generates between 60 kilograms to 225 kilograms. This pollution happens from insufficient buildup and dumping of large plastic debris, for example, road markings and industrial plastic pellets. A simple trip to McDonald's where you are not correctly disposing and sorting cups can not just affect our environment, but our marine life. Do you know how much plastic waste ends up in our oceans? Eight million tons. Because of this, birds, fish, and turtles confuse plastic waste for their food. Hun Within hundreds of species, scientists have found fatal plastic bits in 43% of marine animals, 44% of seabirds, and 86% of sea turtles. Our communities must do better in order for marine life to survive. One way we can reduce plastic pollution is by avoiding to use disposable plastic products. If we can avoid disposable plastic products, we can stop at least a quarter of plastic pollution. Another realistic way is by avoiding another realistic way is by picking up trash and throwing it in the recycling plant. Recycling can. Lastly, try to avoid putting fertilizer on grass. If you do, those chemicals will wash into waterways. Look, plastic is a miracle and very useful for our products and services. However, it is tremendously hurting our oceans, lakes, and animals. There is too much plastic in the world, and every time it is being disposed, a sea creature is endangered. With enough determination, we can positively impact our environment. Thank you for listening.